Yes, thank you very much, Madam Chair, and good morning, Madam Lagarde. Thank you for spending time with us this morning. I read your editorial when you said it's time for action on the climate. But uh, if you look at inflation and uh, financial stability without a, a, a fi an ecological transition, then it could be a problematic issue. I think that it's an important moment in time. Now, as we come uh, towards the end of the Teltras, which have benefited the banking sector so much. Well, let's not go through the whole history again. But when we talk about inflation, note that a, a raise in the inf uh, interest rate cannot affect uh, energy prices. Wouldn't it be more effective to green monetary policy and green refinancing policies? So how would that work in practice? That's probably one of the best ways we can act against inflation. Well, you mentioned uh, Saint-Exupéry. It's never too late to do something. Well, thank you very much, uh, Madame Laluc, for your, uh, for your question. I think what, um, what the European Central Bank has tried to do, and I have certainly uh, pushed as much as I could in that direction under the objectives that have been assigned to the European Central Bank under the treaty. And I have just discussed with, with Mr. McManus the primary objective and the secondary objective and how the latter can be selected provided that they don't prejudice the first one. So on the basis of that background, and recognizing that it is also for many other actors to take the initiative on climate change. As the European Parliament has done, actually, uh, we are trying to import green concerns, the fight against climate change, in all the dimensions of the work that we do. So, what does that mean? It means currently uh, redesigning the models that we use in order to um, forecast, project, anticipate, measure and analyze our action. It means looking at our asset purchase programs. It means lo looking at our collateral policies and determination. And it means also managing our balance sheets and asking through the supervision arm of the ECB, asking banks with which we do business to also manage their balance sheets on the basis of the right measurement of risks. So whether you look at the monetary policy definition, its implementation, and the balance sheet risk management on all three fronts, we're moving ahead. And we have agreed, and the entire governing council unanimously has agreed to approve the action plan in order to make sure that we actually move forward. We have dates, we have deadline, we know when the work needs to be done and, uh, and by whom, and this is something that is actually in progress and that we will deliver against. Now, having a green Teltro program, for instance, is not something that we have considered. Uh, I'm not totally closing the door on that. It's not something that the Governing Council wanted to consider, but we have to be uh, agile and, and able to adjust if, uh, if, if need be. Thank you.